Today, the European delegation's regional seminar on structural dialogue discussed opportunities for the development of Baku's local authority. In attendance were 120 representatives from 17 countries, including Armenia, which is party to the European neighborhood policy. The speakers emphasized that the regional seminar had no relation to the recent events in the region and had been planned long before that. Dialogue is very important. If the governments create the necessary conditions, civil societies will express their views in a timely manner and without fear, declared Roland Kobia, the head of the EU delegation in Baku. Kobia opened with remarks on Azerbaijan's willingness to cooperate with international institutions. He observed that the executive power in Baku fulfills the functions of local authorities in Azerbaijan. The EU is implementing several projects in cooperation with the local executive power, for example, on professional education, another project for children with disabilities, and several new tourism initiatives. Ariston Mediev of the Presidential Administration reported on the development of the local authority. He said that the dialogue between state and the civil society had been a long and complicated process and had now reached partnership level. The appropriate laws have been created and the government allocates funding for civil society, he said. The director of the Peace and Democracy Institute, Leila Yunus, told Objective TV that from now on, Azerbaijan NGOs will be represented in the European Commission. Along with other representatives from Georgia, Yemen and Morocco, I have been selected as an NGO envoy to the EC, she said.